Censorship! People are getting snatched off the street! But then it's oopsie daisy. Shit, I don't want to turn the AC off. I don't want to turn the music off, but I will. And completely off, but the engine is still terrible. This is where I need to get a mic. Sorry I look kind of greasy, y'all. I'm lucky kind of frustrated because the one time I went out and actually did my shit, be in my bag, take my own pictures, but everyone in their mama want to roll around scroll around i picked an empty ass parking lot to uh take my pictures in and it's just cars some cars have business doing being there okay and it was mostly men i don't know why it's just mostly men outside but it's mostly the men that stare like i felt like one truck went out of its way i saw it from across the street it was like some sort of water i don't know water company bro they they do something power washing something and uh they went from across the street from where I was across the street to uh, just pull up, roll right in front of me as I'm taking pictures, look at what I'm doing, piece together what this is, and just move on. There was no purpose for them taking that route. They purposely did that to look at me, bro. I'm just taking pictures. I'm literally living my life, yet people want to do too much. <laughs> I don't like being outside, bro. <laughs> And I'm not sure if I want this to be a YouTube video or a Rumble video because I, yes, am locked in. I am fully on the wave, okay? If you know, you know. If you don't, don't worry about it. It's okay. Let's see, what I wanted to talk about was, uh, well, I'm not even done talking about the situation that happened, bro. Like, I don't know, because I don't be in my car every day like that, but I really think somebody was in my shit. Like, somebody was in my Jeep. I came in here to like prepare my stuff, take my pictures and whatever. And I'm looking and seeing all this shit in my seat. It's in my seat. It's on the passenger seat. I'm like, what is this? And it looks like shit from like my, um, my glove compartment and my center console. I'm like, what the hell? I'm like, I didn't do this. It's all in my seat. Like it's all, it's all over the place. I'm like, what is this? I'm looking around to see if anything's taken because the door was cracked it was like open and i didn't notice it because i'm i'm thinking like oh it's a regular it's regular schmegler day my car is fine i'm i actually went to the back to put in like my equipment so i could just have that in the back i'm looking at the passenger door why is this bitch open why is my passenger door open and not even open it's like slightly open like it's a lightly like somebody closed it but like halfway closed it why is it like that i get in I see the stuff on my seats. I'm like, what is this? I'm analyzing to see whether my radio john has been stolen. It's not my charger. It's not like my charger's still here. My radio thing's still here. Everything's still here. My skateboard is still here. That would have that would low 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 key hurt my feelings, bro. That skateboard was hundred and fifty dollars. Yes. Now, as I'm looking, nothing seems to be taken. It just looks to be rummaged through. Like somebody was looking to see if they could see anything, and nothing was here, babes. Nothing was gonna be here. I'm broke too. But people get on my nerves, bro. They, they're not just like normal weird. They weird weird. They for real weird. I wish it was different, bro. And I'm trying to level up myself to not be afraid to go out and take pictures. Even when it's by myself. I feel like it's a whole safety thing for me. I lost my knife. The knife that I usually like carry on me. Like carry on me. Bro, I could not tell you where that knife is now. And yes, I'm sad about it. And I could just buy like a, a new knife. Like just get a new one. But bro, I like that other knife. So now I'm walking around with my second knife, aka these mini scissors. Just in case somebody wanna... <laughs> bro, this might be a whole rumble video. I cannot. I'm having a hard time censoring myself. But for the YouTube loves, I will. Because I also want to talk about vlogmas vlogmas don't like doing stuff in real life like people are weird people are really weird and i can't do it and i'm not gonna pretend like i can do it because i really cannot do it i'm sorry not sorry okay so vlogmas vlogmas was something i was really thinking about doing like here comes this nosy ass nigga with gray dreads he better be going to some over there because i swear walmart's over there what you walk near me for and then i be thinking like yo i might just be paranoid bro like society has really taught me to not trust anybody don't be around nobody okay like people are crazy people 
be trafficking people. Trafficking is a huge issue and nobody wants to talk about it. Censorship, people are getting snatched off the street. But then it's oopsie daisy. But then it's too bad. But then it's flowers for whoever is missing or gone or lost. Why is it like that? Why is no one, again, censorship. But again, let's get into Vlogmas before I really catch an attitude. So Vlogmas, Vlogmas is something I really want to attempt, y'all. I do, but at the same time, I have no idea how to like keep up with that. I don't think y'all really like piece together like from what y'all see on screen versus behind the scenes. Behind the scenes is constantly editing, constantly recording content, constantly like giving yourself enough time to have it all organized, know what you wanna say, either write a script completely i don't like scripts that it it helps if i have something specific i want to say but i'm just like read a line speak it read a line speak it i'm like i'm not good with like scripts like that outlines outlines are a bit better i'm kind of like messier when it comes to outlines i don't exactly say everything in one spot so it's a little bit of more effort on the editing part but overall like it's a lot of work bro <laughs> and for a daily edit mm, daily I don't know, maybe I could do it. I feel like I've done it. I've done it once in the summer back when I was like 16. That like series of videos, I think that John is like privated or unlisted or something. I have it somewhere, it's still there. You just can't see it. It was called um, Summer 16. It was 2016 and it was the summer of that year. And I was just like daily vlog. It's real cringe to be honest. I might, when I blow up, I might really show it for real, for real because I wanna be like Corey Kenshin and not be afraid of the cringe and show all my cringy videos from like hella time ago <laughs> but yeah um i don't know i just want to see what it be you know i'm not really even finna do all that vlog miss stuff because what it is is just capitalism it's cute capitalism and honestly i just can't participate i don't <laughs> babes babes i do not have the bag you know what's another thing that's pissing me off bro because my door was open i think some sort of like not infestation but i've seen a few i've seen a few little ants i don't know if, if they're ants gnats but they're all over here like crawling on my dashboard and i brought some poison just in case it got complicated but i also brought like i was like killing them with like hand sanitizer but then i like saw too many i was like what is this from the whole situation with my car door and my car in general like bro that made me want to get violent here's everybody want to make eye contact with me do something about it what'd you say that man is literally six nine <laughs> They just want to give me straight eye contact, bro. And I'm not here. It's a lot of men, too. Where are the women? <laughs> women don't be outside. <laughs> or just, like, in the middle of the day. Like, where? what's your job? Do that. Mind your business. Do that. I really can't do this. I'm really trying, y'all, but I can't. <laughs> But yeah, bro, I'm gonna be on some. Hey guys, welcome back. That didn't even sound real to me, bro. And I don't, and that's the thing. I don't know how to do intros like on a realistic like level because I'm real. I'm the be real in real life. Like be for real, be fucking for real. When it comes to like intros, I am trash at them because it's all like, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Even though those are genuine things I need to remind you and say because, you know, that's how the that's how YouTube works. It's favorable when you participate in the foolery. I don't know. I guess I could participate for a check, for a bag. I would. <laughs> like, I'm looking at a nail shop right now that I won't go to because I can't afford that. Like, and I'm lucky, for real, for real, I'm lucky to be able to afford the, the basic things because it's a struggle. I'm only anticipating this shit to get harder. I mean, I'm in a position right now where that's okay but that's not everybody's case bro and i might i might not even be safe for real for real like this recession could hit and hit hard y'all i'm praying for y'all man stay safe but anyways thank you guys i'm gonna switch over to my other video right now did i get any new subscribers now i think the same y'all still watching me some of y'all be completely new like a lot of y'all just be like seeing one or two of my videos and being like ah, there goes sky she's doing something I see her channel. Yeah. Yeah. Subscribe then. If you really want to support a bitch, subscribe. It's free. <laughs> nah, I don't even hate on anybody for like truly not subscribing. Like I I'm one of those people who don't be subscribing. I really just recently started subscribing to people for real. For real. <laughs> 
Same thing with Instagram. I'm like, I'm low-key butthurt that I don't have more followers, but it makes complete sense to have the amount of followers that I have because I don't be on Instagram like that. I don't be on social media like that. Wanting to be a whole social media entrepreneur, wanting to be a whole influencer, but don't be on social media like that. Make it make sense, Cheryl. But I don't know, I'm just out here trying to do me, mind my business, get my back. But yeah, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching and don't forget to tune in next Friday. See, you see that? Didn't that feel fake? Didn't that feel unrealistic? I'm just playing y'all. Y'all know I love y'all. Confused, like why is it the same person? You ever get like kind of anxious? When somebody like likes a bunch of your like photos and reels, it's like what you want. And then on top of that, they don't subscribe. Bitch, huh? Not subscribe. How are you gonna like all my pictures and not follow me? Just follow me, bro. And if it sounds like I'm begging for people to follow and subscribe and because I know they do. I know you do already. Quit playing with me. I check the stories. Sometimes, bro. I don't even be checking the stories all the time. Let me check my stories right quick. Bro, 40 people. 40 people done watched my story from yesterday. That's the most? Bro. <laughs> Not to sound ridiculous, but that's the most I've ever had. Like, it's usually, at best, 26, something like that. At worst, it's like 8 people, 10 12 people. Yes, bro. I'm beginner beginner. <laughs> Y'all don't believe me, bro. All right. I'm finna go. Let's get controversial with my rumble video.